So now we will create the contact section. So create a div and give it a class is equal to row margin top dash five and ID is equal to contact. Then create a div and give it a class main one called dash lg dash five. So basically it's a five column div and inside this we create another div and give it a class equal to card padding along all sides is 5 then we have a background and border radius after that we have a paragraph and some class and style planning or training so it will look like this now and inside this we will create the h1 give it a class is equal to font with bold main h3 and the text is contact us so let me refresh this so it will look like this now and uh, after this we will create a form tag and give it a inside this and give it a class is equal to row let me add some space here then we will create another div and give it a class equal to cold dash lg dash 12 and padding along y axis is 3 and inside this we have an input tag and type is equal to text so it will look like this now so let's required so it will required and give it a class form dash control and padding along y axis is 4 and give it a placeholder name so it's a name then after the 12 column div let's close this create another div and uh, give it a class is equal to cold dash lg dash 12 and padding along y axis is 3 then uh, inside this we have an input and type is equal to email uh, and it is also the required field and give it a class equal to form dash control and placeholder email so we'll style it later so let's add the third one which is the last one for the message so close this and give it a class equal to cold dash lg dash 12 and the padding long wax is 3 then we have the text area so let me scroll down scroll down scroll down this contact oops uh, contact us form check in time token set. so this is here now give it a class is equal to form dash control and uh, it is also required and give it a style border radius 20 pixel and uh, give it a row placeholder is message and we need to also add the row here so let's rows is equal to 5 then, so after this we will create a div and give it a class equal to text dash left and padding left dash 4 and padding to dash 2 let me refresh this so now we need to add the button here and give it a class equal to btn btn dash md btn dash primary margin right 4 and padding logo x axis is 5 then we have style font size 20 pixel and type is equal to submit and give it a id is equal to hope and href here so it will not move so it will not detect the page so after this so contact us form is ready now we need to add the picture image here so this is inside the five column div now we need to create the seven column div for the image as we done before so create a div and give it a class called dash lg dash seven and for the medium device it is six column and image source is equal to either slash images slash cat dot png let me give it a class so it will look good and image dash float give it a l to equal sample image so html part is done now let me refresh this so now we need to style the form so let's close this and this is seven column div and set the row so let's open the style.css and close this so we need to write our style.css code here <coughs> so let's target the input field and 
first target the class which is let me add some space here so so target the form dash control class and give it a padding border ram and the background color white then we have a border color f2 f2 f4 then we have color then we have transition 0 0.4 second box shadow none then we have outline none and border radius 15 pixel after this let's target the focus so when we click on this input field so give it an outline none and border one pixel solid then we have a box shadow after that we have an outline then give it a border color so now when we click on this it will give you this effect now similarly for the text area so let's add the same thing for here outline border then we have border box shadow after that give it outline then we have a border color so it will also this now we need to add the hover effect so we want the same effect for the hover so input colon hover give it an outline then we have a border and uh, similarly for the box shadow to that we have outline then we have border color so similarly for the text area outline none border one pixel solid color is ad6 Four three six. Then we have the box shadow. After that, we have an outline. Then we have a border color. So our style loop CSS part is also done now. Let me open the screen so you will see the effect. So when we hover on this, it will give you the nice effect, and it will stay here when you click on this. So our contact us section is also done now only footer part is left and the smooth scrolling effect in the next video we will add the smooth scroll effect and the create our footer